you know, people started getting uh, more used to him. He's found, like, a little bit of trouble, but it's also a period where a player, you know, has to learn his surroundings when people start learning him yeah. in a place where they have very different styles. Because I know he moved from, like, Oregon or Washington. Washington, yeah. Washington, yeah. That's what separates the good players from the best players, being yeah. able to adapt to the people who are adapting towards you. Yep. And it looks like Costas Moss is doing a very good job adapting to Rice's play style. Yeah. Oh, I don't, I don't think he tried to just gimp him. That was interesting, Kate. But I feel like if if anybody's gonna give Game Watch a hard time, it would be Mario, because or Game Cheek. Of, yeah, or Cheek. I, 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 I forgot Cheek was in the game. Don't know how. <laughs> or um, top tiers. <laughs> just any top tier. I play low tier, man. I don't. Don't worry about those characters. <laughs> but uh, Game Watch's uh, moves aren't super punishable, but once Mario can get in and he can punish, get that one punish, he's gonna put up a lot of damage. Yeah. Goss is just really good about uh, covering his weaknesses. Yeah. That's what it's really about. Rice uh, hasn't been able to get as easy juggles. That was a really good grab, though. Getting him right before the, the Hurtbox frame came out. That yeah. was definitely necessary because, uh, you know, that forward air has a lot of power. Down tilts Windbox, sending Rice to the heavens. But he comes right back down. What goes up must come down, but will Rice get back up from going down? He does. See, he goes for the smart option. Just jump, stay out of the area. Since he is doing a charge smash, you have time to safely get back onto the stage. Yeah, Kasumas does have a pretty bad habit of consistently, constantly going for the down smash as a ledge option. Um, talked to him a few times about it. That's pretty much his main weakness, if any. Uh, he just kind of very repetitive on his, uh, woo, very repetitive on his uh, ledge guards. Back air clips him clean. It's looking pretty solid so far. I think that, uh, you know, Rice does have an, uh, an opportunity here to get a solid lead. But Koss is a master of oh. punishing landings. He gets those up smashes. Looking a lot like Mario himself. Yeah, do not land on Game & Watch, guys. He will continuously send you in the air with that toot toot and then make you land on him. Back airs. Rice, though, with the ferocity and the spacing oh to make sure goodness. that even though uh, there was opportunities to, to respond with attacks, he had his hurt boxes not where the hit boxes were. And that is the very basis of how to play Smash Bros. That's Don't have your hurt boxes where your hit boxes are. Because when they intertwine, you take 93% to somebody else's 16. Oh, wow, that was really cool looking. He kind of like slid and got the down tilt. Yeah. Up smash, not gonna be doing a very good shield. The up B's right out of it. Gotta get, gotta do true stuff, guys, against those very fast character, characters with very fast uh, aerial movements. Up smash, oh man. He got caught in the jab right there, unfortunately trying to cover other options, but too late. And down smash takes it off. Rice takes a victory. A very important victory, honestly. Think winning game one is so important so that if it goes to game three, you have the stage counter pick. And that momentum. Is your choice. And you also you have the momentum going into game two, you have the counter pick for, for game three. Yeah. If your momentum doesn't even carry over to game two. But let's see where he's. Mario Galaxy, I'm doing. Let's do this, guys. Good stage, great music. Walk offs. Gotta love it. Oh, wait, we're really. Oh, I really thought we were doing this. Wait, are we doing this? No, it's just button checks here. I don't know why. Maybe they feel like their buttons are a little bit different, you know? I feel like maybe uh, Costas Masa's grab was supposed to be an up smash, and then he just feels like his controls are a little weird. You know it. Sometimes you just gotta check. You gotta make sure. Just gotta, just, I mean, just press some buttons. It feels good to press buttons, man. Because then you don't, you know, especially when you don't get punished from it. Because I love pressing buttons. Is that up taunt? Yeah, I think that's up taunt. The best taunt, guys, for Mario is when he takes his hat off. You know, it's kind of surprising, though, because if Mario has the ability to just turn huge whenever he wants without a mushroom, why doesn't he use that? Yeah. That'd, be, he that'd also, be really important. He could also be Fire Mario at any time as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's revealing his secrets here to Sakura. He's like, yo, Sok. Young let Sok. Me. Let me, let me, let me, let me. I can really do <laughs> anything I want at any time. Well, that's the what mushrooms, the fire flowers, the tanukis. Nah, I don't really need it. Dude, I wish we had tanuki. That would be an amazing recovery, man. 
but that would be pretty broken. It's Mario. It's Mario Maker, guys. You can do whatever you want with Mario Maker. All right. Number seven versus number four, Rice versus Costas Moss. Rice up a game right now. Probably actually a little bit of, a, you know, momentum taken away from Rice there. When you doing your butt checks and all that, maybe the ferocity isn't 100% there, but he is getting the damage that he needs right now. Oh, man. Nice down here, but people have been falling out of it. They've been learning. DI down. A smash? No, a smash. Not Rice doing... actually going for the cape. He was still within range of up smash as well. Yeah, Rice is um, not getting punished for landing right on top of Costas Moss. I feel like Costas Moss is getting to play a little bit more patiently. Costas does have a, a habit of kind of just going ham. Um, I feel like patient is the best way to play against Rice because Rice loves to punish people in the flashiest way as possible. Yeah. He will get. He will. He wants to be a Giphy. He wants to be a the. What is it? Hitbox. Other Giphy cat thing. I don't know. I'm not cool, guys. I don't. I don't odd know. Hot shot. Hot. Hot shot. I'm, I'm not cool, guys. I'm not tech savvy. Cost is trying to push him away with the two two. Back. Rice catches up in damage. Cost gets a little bit more rage. And now going in for an up smash punish. Rice is putting on the pressure. Oh, and he finally gets it. Very good spacing. It works. He knows now when to make things work for him. You know? Backside of down smash. Surprise it doesn't kill, but it is pretty far off to one side of the stage. Doesn't get the tech, but it's not that big of a deal. Very low percent. Up smash. I just wish, really want a cost. Just don't have a lot of up smash. Up smash is it's game and watch. Like, game and watch equals up smash. It is invincible. Very low uh, amount of lag on it. Like, look at this. He just man can just throw out a bunch of moves. And you can't also, really punish it. Oh! Mario got up smash up smash of his own. It's a pretty interesting time seeing uh, these guys to kind of come back and forth. Koss has a solid lead, but Rice can bring this back at any time. I feel like he's doing a lot better. Ooh, and that's going to take it. Yeah, Commentator's curse. Instant. You got to be instant. ready. You got to be ready for Koss's Moss when just be all you ready to check. Any game to watch. Just be ready. That up B is invincible. Any character even. You need to be ready yeah. for all sorts of events and happenings. We are moving on to game three. Just be always be ready, guys. Always be prepared. In the famous words of Scar from Lion King, be prepared. <laughs> but Scar is dead. I mean, uh, I mean, Mufasa... He wasn't, he wasn't prepared. That's why. Mufasa was not prepared. And Scar is over... Uh, Playing Street Fighter right now. Thanks for the thanks for the spoiler, man. All the people who haven't, all the uncultured people who haven't seen Lion no, King, they have not. They know all the. It's examples because now. the Scar, the the melee player, is actually playing. Oh, he is. Street Fighter over in the corner right now. That's oh, why I said Scar. See, one of these days I'm gonna be good at Street Fighter. But not, today is not that day. What? Throwing out a bunch of back airs is costs boss. Putting up a good amount of damage. Oh, see, there it is. Costas Moss is throwing out more up smashes, and Rice just doesn't know what to do yet. Yeah, Rice really can't get around those. And then when he follows up with down tilt, it's like, well, I guess we have to reset. It seems like as good as it's going to get. He has to catch him before um, the up smash actually comes out, so that uh, there's no... What's the word I'm looking for? Delay, lag, time. Pizza. Armor. Oh. There's going. no armor on the other side. I definitely thought you were going with pizza Before with that. My bad. Out. You know what? I can see why you would think that. Pizza's always the answer. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Waiting for double up smash. Double up smash is amazing tool. It's crazy to see how even these matches are being right now. And this is the difference between, uh, you know, rank four and rank seven. Yeah, and it's not that. It's not that different. Yeah. But and this isn't even Rice's main character. That's why. This isn't that's even my final form. <laughs> He has not gotten Golden Frieza. Lakers Frieza is what I like to call it. Dash attack. I feel like a fat forward smash would have worked as well. Yeah, Rice actually has been going for the jumping air dodge really, really often. I feel like there's an opportunity to punish there, you know? If you know what's going to be there, leave a hitbox up. Yeah, it's, especially when you're playing against Game & Watch. Like, punishing is probably one of the hardest things to do, so... If you can, you need to take advantage of it. Down tilt, oh. not going to be doing it. Oh! Did you see? 
that DI right there. Down tilt seems you at such a strange range. Get up attack well placed, being that the uh, up smash wasn't reversed. He rang his bell. Up smash. There we go. I feel like uh, Mario players kind of feel bad every time they get up smash. They're like, oh, this is what it's like. Oh, man, why would I pick this character? I want to play a character that can Oh, this is bad. Rice has no jump. Oh, and he takes it. Gimped all the way off stage. This is why you save your jump, ladies and gentlemen. You can get caught in situations where you have no hope. There's no hope. No chance. That's what